Hi, mummy ka birthday. So happy birthday, Rajbala. She's 63 years old. This is like like a old post to my mother. I don't think I've ever told her how much she's loved and valued by us, especially by me. <clears throat> so my mother is. Imagine this. So there is this this dainty little, pretty little, eighteen year old who marries this Rapinda Mami guy, <coughs> who's average looking, and she's she's the hot girl he's found. Uh, in a arranged marriage and she has a kid at uh, 18, 19 and uh, so very early on like lots of responsibility happened but here is this woman who has an inherited softness to her and she's been a state level hockey player and history uh, she studied and um, she has her own sense of self right and she she gets into this household and uh, one of my core memories of my mother is of course she was a brilliant cook and she was always well turned out very very good looking uh, <clears throat> uh and my mother's never worn a speck of makeup with um, her skin and her just one kajal and she looks brighter uh so my idea of beauty is simplistic because of my mother uh my idea of care is uh, is uh, is gentle and food blend because of my mother uh, my house is always spick and span because of my mother um uh, uh, there is a certain aesthetic that i have because of my mother uh, which is just simple and clean um uh so uh, having said all of this uh, one of my core memories is that uh, i'm army kid so we were uh, uh, once we were opening these boxes and in from one whole box there were these medals uh, sports medals uh, we belonged to my mother for hockey and my father got really jealous and he's like ask her to show her uh, mark sheet <laughs> because he was really good in, uh, in studies my mother was really good at sports so that's like one of my core memories and i've seen her in like bell bottoms at that time the 70s so she's like really hot um uh so uh, but when you are in a household like this and you're so different like this is a strong aggressive uh household uh you're a gentle person in it i think what happens is you kind of get lost and don't get value for your for your quietness and the quietness can be considered a weakness and i think that must have happened uh and that has happened and um, but my mother has overcome a lot she's overcome the loss of her spouse she's she lost her parents especially her mother uh she has overcome almost losing her leg she's a state level hockey player and um uh, a lot a lot right and uh, had a kid who was who was born in seven months which is me and all sorts of things from early on and uh, army life which is which requires you to move a lot in all of this she retained her gentleness she retained her charm she retained her ability to connect with everybody she has a simple way of connecting with people which does not require to read any books or know any data points she'll just as a human interact with you and that i think is beautiful forever i have been trying to imbibe that quality of humanness that my mother has the gentleness that she has and because we were like the so called at least me and my father were these aggressive lot around her i think we never really uh, held that really with, with enough value and we ended up judging it and what that does is that we look at gentleness as, as weakness which it isn't actually it's actually the highest level of strength but it takes a while for you to realize this and then you can you can be you can turn out to be a terrible daughter at times because you just don't value gentleness enough today i do but i haven't for the longest time and sorry ma uh but my mother's gentleness is inspiring and uh, uh what i realized over time is as long as <clears throat> uh her independence the detachment that she has the fact that she uh, never gets into anybody's uh, interferes with anybody's life lets everybody be uh, uh has is very involved in community is very involved with her cancer and is very involved uh, uh in the community in general the society in general and like she has her own beat uh, that is very inspiring as somebody at her age right i mean she she is she is brilliant i mean she can do it all herself she doesn't need any of us she went and had a heart surgery on her own uh, before we could reach she had got it done and uh, so all of that so my mother has all of these examples of strength which are quite uh, but very critical you know we we value men and their and their strength we don't value women and their quiet strength my mother i think is a shining example of that she also overcome not being respected by her own family members sometimes her own children like us sometimes we have not looked at her as a as a woman we have just looked at her as a mother uh, it took me forever to now realize that when she is a woman and she needs to have fun and she needs to have holidays and stuff like that it takes a while to get there uh, we give a lot of respect to our parents but do we really treat them as humans uh, i think sometimes we just have to look at them as adults and realize that you know ultimately it's just a girl who's older it's nothing more than that and if we can just give love and affection from that perspective uh, it all kind of falls in place so, uh, i am wishing like the world of happiness for my mother health um, um, a companion if she wants it um, 
uh, just joy and whatever she wants to come to her easily uh, and she's inspiring to us she's inspired to me to her grands and kabir she's inspired to everybody around her and uh, to see her lead the life that she leads with the joy that she, that she leads it is is just just impeccable and ma happy birthday and keep looking pretty uh, keep inspiring us and uh, hope to be a better daughter to you f- uh, now and forever and sorry for not being that in the past and i'm learning i'm learning i'm getting there and um, side note you should be nice to your mothers because uh, when you're nice to them somehow life is easier there's more money in it uh their blessings work wonders uh we all grow in life because of the blessings that our parents have for us especially our mothers we come from there uh so that's that's sacred and uh, the sooner we realize it uh, i think easier life gets mine is uh, way more easy today because i just value my mother a lot more her gentleness is is massive beautiful happy birthday rajbala